So let's talk about your practice room. Where do you practice and why do you practice there? Now, if you're at a university setting like this, you don't have much choice. You have to use the given practice rooms or maybe you could sign out a classroom or something like that. Um, one thing you should never fall in for the trap is to practice in a restroom or a stairwell. Why? Well, because those rooms have so much reverb and they cover up all of your mistakes, all your little glitches, all your little splias, spliced notes, that it gives you a tremendous false sense of security, which is very dangerous to your playing. Because when you get back into the real world and you have to play maybe in a dry setting, like this room, this trumpet studio here is pretty dry, or you have to audition in a dry room, you're in trouble, suddenly you notice all these errors and all these mistakes that you never noticed before and you can't figure out what happened. So I think it's really, really important that when you practice, you find a room that's fairly dry, not lethally dry, but fairly dry, um, so that you can hear all of the minor articulation things that come up on our playing, your cutoffs, your attacks, everything. That way when you get into a room that has a little bit more reverb, you're gonna feel fantastic. It's gonna feel wonderful, especially if you get into a nice recital hall with some good acoustic uh, reverb in there. So think about where you're practicing at home, think about where you're practicing at school, and find the place that works the best for what you're trying to achieve.